welcome to Music with the Message. I'm Pat Stockdale, and this is... Dana Watkins. How are you doing? We're happy to be here with you this week. I think this is week number five, if I'm not correct. It is week number five. Hey, thanks for tuning in to Music with a Message. We appreciate uh, all the, the new views, and, and uh, uh, it's given us the impression that people are liking what we're doing. So uh, if you do like us, uh, be sure to hit the like and subscribe button and the uh, little bell notification uh, so that you'll be notified when we have new content, which is generally every Sunday morning. This little gem right here uh, is a Collins O1G, uh, O1G, and we've named her Chloe. Uh, and why have we named her Chloe? Well, it's a Christian name. It does mean Christian. It means green sprout, which is new life. It also means bright and clear, and Pat says she's very bright and clear. <laughs> she is, uh, and this is, I love, everybody uh, who knows me knows that I love guitars. I'm so blessed to have this one. Uh, this is uh, this is my favorite, Colleen, so don't tell the, the other one. Uh, but this, uh, the top on this, if you're a guitar picker and you just want to know these things, it's got a German spruce top, uh, and it has a walnut back and sides. It's a 12 fret guitar. Uh, ebony bridge on it and uh, some mahogany neck. Uh, it's a slotted uh, headstock, which I love these guitars. They're they're little, but they're they're loud. So, anyways, that's my guitar talk for today. <laughs> Dana has a message for you that that's correlated with that song. Uh, if that isn't love, tell us about it. All right. Well, we'll allow your guitar talk because we do have a lot of musicians who tune in to us. So. And they know, they, they appreciate what you have to say about those guitars. I hope so. <laughs> I like them. But anyway, welcome to Music with a Message. So, you know, uh, we started this series to try to just bring some uplifting uh, things to folks, just to, to encourage people. And so today I sang one of my favorite songs uh, that I learned as a child. When I was a little girl, my grandmother on Sunday mornings, we were getting ready for church. She would put a record on in the big stereo in the living room, but we could hear it all through the house. And one of the records that she would put on was Jimmy Swaggart. And this is a song that he would sing. And it's a Dottie Rambo song, but such a beautiful song about the love of Jesus. So really, I just want to take a few minutes to just share um, something encouraging for you. If you are a Christian and you're watching this, you know uh, from experience, know without a doubt what the love of Jesus means in our lives. It, uh, it's one of those things that when you're having your struggles or trials or temptations, things like that, and you feel the love of Jesus when you turn to Him and pray, and it's just something that within your heart you know that you have a Savior that loves you. And so I just want to just say a word of encouragement that no matter what you're going through, and I have a number of friends that are on my prayer list that are having some struggles and some tough times, but uh, I know that Jesus loves them and He is there to comfort them and to get them through those tough times, as well as me when things happen like that. So um, just wanted to just share that if you are watching and you don't know the love of Jesus, I encourage you to please open your Bible or find a scripture. Look it up on the internet, John 3, 16, for God so loved the world that he gave his only son, that whosoever should believe in him would not perish but have everlasting life. And there's so much more to that scripture because we do serve Jesus and he loves us so much. And so I want to leave you with this scripture, and then I hope that this is encouraging to you because it sure is to me, and I think about it many times. And this is the promise of Jesus, and, and it says, Who shall separate us from the love of Christ? Shall trouble or hardship or persecution or famine or nakedness or danger or sword? As it is written, For your sake we face death all day long. We are considered as sheep to the slaughter. No, in all these things we are more than conquerors through Him who loved us. For I am convinced that neither death nor life, nor angels nor demons, nor present nor future, nor any powers, neither height nor depth, 
nor anything else in all creation will be able to separate us from the love of God that is in Christ Jesus our Lord. And that's found in Romans chapter 8, and that is verses 35 through 39. And, you know, nothing can separate us from the love of Christ. You know, He is there for us through all the times, through the good times, through the bad times. And just want you to be encouraged and know that you have a Savior who loves you. And if you haven't turned to Him in a while, I hope that you will. And if there's anyone out there that is searching and you have a prayer request, Pat's going to tell you how you can uh, send us something so that we will know and we truly will pray for you if there's something we can pray for you for if there's you know if you, there's anything on your heart that you that you'd like to share with us we would be glad to share with you so just that. yeah and uh be sure to to uh pray for this for this little uh, ministry thing that we have going on music with a message uh prayer request anything like that you can uh, whatever's on your mind that you want to talk to us about Reach out to us at musiccitymusichall at gmail.com, musiccitymusichall at gmail.com. I'll post it uh, in the, uh, put a little link there in the description. Um, Hope you like what we're doing. Uh, If you do, uh, throw us a comment uh, on the video and just give us a little comment and let us know. Uh, what you think about things or uh, anything that we might need to change. Unless it's talking about guitars, I'm going to have to <laughs> pull rank uh, with that because I like, I like guitars now, just saying. So we may have to talk about that. But anyways, thank you for tuning in. Uh, thanks for all the response that we've already gotten, the new viewers, the new subscriptions. Uh, by the way, uh, when you subscribe to this channel, it helps us out a lot uh, with the YouTube uh, the way that it pushes uh, this video out to to like-minded uh, Christians out there. So uh, please be sure to, again, like and subscribe and comment uh, and give us a thumbs up. That helps a lot. Um, this is Music with a Message uh, here on this channel. We love you very much. We hope you have a great week, a uh, great work week coming up. Uh, look for us again next Sunday morning. We'll have another Hopefully my voice will be back and and I'll be able to get in here and sing a little bit. I like doing that as well. (laughs) Uh, We'll see you guys. Thanks for tuning in. We'll see you further on up the road. Bye now. Bye.